personal best. So we've got the uh, wheelchair javelin at one end, the visually impaired javelin at the other end, and now more events on the track. Second semi-final of the men's 400 metres, T46, which features the London 2012 champion. We'll see him in lane three. Alongside him is Etienne Calderon of Cuba. London 2012 winner, Gunter Matzinger of Austria. Silver in Christchurch two years ago at the last World Championships. In lane four, Julian Brisento of Venezuela. David Basca of Jamaica's in lane five. Absent from lane six is Emicarlo Souza. Doesn't start, so it's Samuele Gobbi of Italy, who you expect maybe to sit for us if he wins. He's the oldest in the field, by the way. Only one born in the 70s, and only by a couple of months. And Elias Dimalunde of Namibia is in lane eight. 50.07 is personal best set this year. It's the first three who qualify, and the next two fastest losers. 52.63 is the cutoff time for the fastest losers. Etienne Calderon of Cuba in two. Matzinger of Austria, three. Bresenio, Venezuela, four. Basco, Jamaica, five. Gobi, Italy, seven. And Ndimalunde of Namibia is in lane eight. Top three go through to the final of the men's 400 meters, T46. And they are away in a decent start by Brasenio in four and also Basco in five, but Matzinger in three, realistically the man to watch, having won in London last year, and he's already overtaking Brasenio in the lane alongside, and he's shooting clear. Calderon's also doing well too, which means Brasenio is falling way back. Matzinger on the far straight, and also going good is the Jamaican David Basco. This could be a very fast time, maybe between these two, and then the rest are battling for the other automatic spot, but Matzinger in three for Austria. Absolutely flying through. His personal best, if you were to match it here, would be a championship record also. And Calderon, who started very poorly, has now recovered very well. Matzinger, well in the lead. Calderon alongside in second. And Basco will come through in third. Matzinger will take it. Wins it very well in around uh, 49.6. Calderon second, Basco third. And they're the three who advance to the final. The second outside is personal best. It's the season's best for him. 49.6, so unofficial. Can't give you the official time because there was a photographer standing in front of the screen where the official times come up very quickly after, but it is confirmed as official. And the London 2012 champion and the World Championship runner up in Christchurch. Very comfortable. They're trying to send out a sign. Calderon alongside, second for Cuban personal best for second, third, and fourth did well also. They weren't really testing. It can be quite difficult when you're still in your lane to the back straight because you haven't straightened up by that stage. Just trying to glance across and see where everyone is, but Matzinger and Calderon really weren't ever in that much difficulty. Must have been horrible for Brasenio in lane four, seeing two people overtake very quickly. Matzinger wins it, 49.6. Calderon second with a personal best. Likewise, Basco. Gobby goes through as the fastest loser in four. Well done, Gobby of Italy. I've sent a message down to Trackside asking if that cameraman cannot keep putting his camera down in front of the digi board because every time there's a, a timer.